Sets up a second down and 10. They go empty. Flag down. They're working against Gardner again. This one is caught! And out of bounds inside the five-yard line at the three to Jacob Harris. When you saw the offsides, what do you do? Take a shot on a free play. As he finds a little atonement there, Gabriel hands it off. And stopped at the one-yard line is Greg McRae. And the momentum staying alive. Touchdown, Knights. Gardner keeps those legs turning, will not be denied. That's just effort one, two, and a little bit of help from the big guys at UCS. It's a scrum, and they find their way to the efficiency of this Bearcats offense. This one is good. Just got it inside that right upright. Gabriel, wide open, touchdown, Marlon Williams. Running his route, cleans everything up for Marlon Williams. Nobody there to account for him. With his versatility this year. Looking at second down and 16 and sacked by Morris Brash. Decommitted and came to UCF. This time sacked for a loss of about seven on the play by Brooks. Curtis Brooks got there. Seeing the Knights defense here on this drive. First and ten, Ritter has all day and finds Dokes out of the backfield and another first down at the 28 yard line. Jared Dokes, one of the leaders on that team. Wiley in motion. Ritter hits his target. Wiley turns it north south. Touchdown, Bearcats! Well, here you see right here, Josh Wiley's just going to work up and over. Gilliard's working on a man to man coverage. And as he works across the field, Gilliard cannot stay with him. Pass thrown out in front, catch a ball where Wiley can run after the reception. He hits the sidelines. Really come to life here these last three possessions. Important drive here for the Knights. They're run the ball. Nice seam over the right side. First down and a lot more for Anderson into Cincinnati territory. Gonna let it run down to six now. Five. Gabriel looks off the defense. Fires complete to Williams for the first down. That's the guy that moves the chains for the Knights. And when the lineman goes around, feel like that, that tells him run. So that's a good call. All right, Rodgers are... Rules analyst, wide open, room service, caught, and a first down, Jordan Jones couldn't keep his balance, but they moved the chains. Ritter on the move and is going to be pushed out of bounds at about the nine-yard line by Bethune. Made one earlier from 47, and he makes it a one-point football game, 14 to 13. I mean, again, and one of those touchdowns was helped aided by a muff punt. Gabriel with nowhere to go. And he's going to be sacked back at the 20-yard line by Darian Beavers. Big step and opportunity here today. First and 10 for Ritter. Quick out pattern complete. And down the sidelines, Pierce, Alec Pierce, making an impact down to the 34-yard line. Second down and 10. Ritter complete over the middle. That's Wiley. Still in the open field and still on his feet. Wiley, Houdini, touchdown Cincinnati. Oh, he hit him with some sauce. Cincinnati going fast. Dokes takes the handoff and no, he doesn't. Great press to digitation and handiwork by Ritter, who waltzes in for the score. The sidelines, and he walks in for the second score. As I mentioned, a tell of two quarters, 14-3 in the first quarter. One coming from 36. I like it. I like it. I like it. And Obarski drills it through to make it a two-point football game with a second to go in the first half. Leonard Taylor in motion. Ritter looking across the middle, caught in a first down catch by Taylor, still on his feet in bounds. 
And they move the chains out to the 33-yard line. Boy, Leonard Taylor has done a nice job tonight. Second and five. Pierce came in and got a nice block on the edge and totes all the way down to the 22-yard line. Corey Thornton might have saved the touchdown on the play, Quint. He played for the Knights defensively. Young in motion. Ritter going to take off, try and do it himself, and he does. Still on his feet. Desmond, the magician, down to the one. And talking about it to Richie Grant. Smith is two for two from today, 47 and 26, and now this one from 22. We'll say that Texas A&M agree. has no upward mobility. Clemson, plenty to play for. Texas A&M with that win up against Florida. Here's Williams. Great point. He, Dusty, he's got a point on that one. That, that, that pass complete that's, for the first yeah, down. To me, that's a really difficult question down the road. Greg McRae in the backfield. Gabriel over the middle, has his man, Williams, put his hat down, touchdown, UCF, you got it. Reminds me of A.J. Brown a little bit, mm, the way he plays. Going for two, and this one... Caught miraculously. Oh, somebody sorted out. Somebody comes out of the pack for the two point conversion. Marlon Williams. Was it Williams? It will not be denied today. <laughs> Third quarter could have been an interception, and instead, it's Marlon Williams grinding, doing whatever he can to get in the end zone. We got action. Quality player in the back end of that defense. On second and ten, Brooks. Into traffic, picked off. Forrest, still on his feet, spins and brought down at the 17-yard line. That's his first interception for Dylan Gabriel. Over the top, got the ball over, touchdown. Desmond Ritter scores it. Desmond Ritter go over the top, got those long arms. Excellent look. The outgaining UCF yardage wise 371 to 298. Ritter escapes downfield and caught by the tight end Leonard Taylor. Not sure it was even intended for him, but he picks up the first down. Play clock at two, they get it off. Ritter wide open, tight end Taylor, touchdown. So they tighten the noose a little bit more on this ball game. That drum sometime soon, and Ritter writing, reacting ridiculously good on that play. Link, physical at the line of scrimmage, and a quality cover man. Third and six, and a sack. Gabriel brought down for a loss of about six by Darian Beavers. Second and goal. Gabriel, touchdown, flash! Jalen Robinson. Robinson. Robinson, little head fake to the left, almost a dead leg, wide open, pass on time. Gabriel into the end zone, open! And caught by Harris. It's a three-point football game with plenty of time. Dokes in the backfield. The guy that regularly does the heavy lifting. Ritter keeps it on the RPO. Sprinting and inside UCF territory. And he shows them the way with the first down. On the other side. He was looking for his tight end, Taylor, who was covered, so he does it himself. Desmond Ritter with the first end goal for the Bearcats. It's a long shot, but they got a chance. Dylan Gabriel completes it. There's the first lateral, and it's going to be over. Done. That's the end of it. Beavers says, let's go home.
Fickle and the Bearcats improve to 8 and 0. Oh. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.